It's in the name. The third fight of E3 is between the third major contender to the OAFF title Brock Lesnar and glass cannon extraordinaire Eric Ash. Considering your love of Ash, do I even need to ask who you think will win? Not Eric. No. If there is anyone who can deal with his size, it is Lesnar. Oh. Not sure it was a smart no. choice there. Not to follow up on the ground and instead oh. trade blows with Ash. I think Lesnar wants to show people his loss to Justino was a fluke and will be looking not just for the win, but also to impress. That is the worst attitude to have during a butterbean fight. Maybe, but maybe not for Lesnar. Look at him picking Eric up and showing him to the crowd. Like a prized pig or something. Might work out well for him. That feat alone will surely be worth flare points. Not if he keeps allowing Eric to flatten him like this. Just me, or Lesnar is struggling to catch Eric. Unlike Lesnar, Butterbean seems to have taken this fight very seriously. He even took a few steps back to get momentum for this punch. This might be it. I am not sure what happened, but it looks bad. Lesnar is signaling for a doctor. This is not a KO. Lesnar tapped out and is bleeding profusely. It was confirmed. Lesnar suffered a bad head injury and will even lose E4. Now this is a fight he will surely want to forget. Despite a mediocre rating of 83, the fighters will split the 0.5 bloody points, and sadly for Eric he will not take home the extra point for a KO. I was also told Lesnar will get 0.1 flare points for lifting and tossing Eric. Not sure it was worth it if I am honest. This fight is so far the shortest fight in the OAFF, with just 55 seconds on the clock, which means Lesnar was involved in both the longest and the shortest fights in the OAFF, as his fight with Helio lasted 6 minutes and 2 seconds. Say what you want about Lesnar, he sure delivers memorable fights. Butterbean can be happy at least, at least for now he is the number one ranked fighter in the OAFF. This loss and injury, on the other hand, will be a big hurdle for Lesnar to overcome.